Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make a fake flames coming from exhaust. For this video I've downloaded a Porsche 911 revving sound effect and set markers where the crack's starting from. I will animate fake flames on the sound. Cut the video where you are going to add flames at the start and at the end. In my case, I will animate only this part of the video. Go to Window and Enable Tracker. Then go to Tracker and Track Camera, Expand Advanced and check Detailed Analysis. Select all the dots at the exhaust point. Right-click and press Create Solid and Camera. Cut the solid, we only need it where the camera is tracked. Let's adjust the solid first, go to Transform and Scale it until it covers the car, then change the orientation like in the video. Nice, now hide the solid layer, press the eye icon. Then grab the pen tool and draw a mask on the exhausts. Make sure you are making masks on a solid layer. Add a saber effect to solid layer. Enable the solid, click on the eye icon. Go to saber effect, click on render settings, change composite settings to transparent. Now go to customize core and change core type to layer masks. Go to presets and you can select here, fire, energy or inferno. That looks more realistic with a few edits. Let's adjust the saber. Copy my settings or play around until it will make you happy. Also adjust the mask if needed, you can make them bigger or smaller or position them. Let's animate the flames at the revs. Create keyframe to end offset and set the value to 0, then go a few frames forward and set the value to 100. Then go one frame forward and set keyframe to 0 again. You need to match the keyframes at the high revs. If you don't know how to open a beat of the audio in After Effects, simply select the audio layer and press L twice. Set markers on the beats, so you will know where the next beat drops. Nice, it looks realistic, let's copy the keyframes and paste them to every high rev. The middle keyframe should be at the high rev, because that keyframe is 100%. Cool, do the same process to every marker you set. That looks amazing. There is one problem, all flames are the same looking. So let's change the animation and make it a bit more realistic. I will leave the first one and will change all the rest. Cut the layer where the three key frames are. Select the layer and let's change saber settings. Here I will remove one mask. For this one, I will remove both masks and change the mask to ellipse tool. Change Saber settings. You can copy mine or play around the settings. Duplicate the mask and move it to another exhaust, if there's two in your case. Cool. Do the same process to the rest of the video, change flames or shapes as you wish. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.